Hello everyone, I'm going to be reviewing F9 or Fast and Furious 9. I have officially watched uh, this movie. I watched it on Friday if you want proof. Um, that I've seen it. If I open it, there you go. Fast and Furious 9. I've watched it. Uh, for all those people that think I haven't watched it, I have. Um, but yeah, Fast and Furious 9 is directed by Justin Lin, produced by Neil H. Mortez, Vin Diesel, Jeff Cronsberg, uh, Joe Ruth, Justin Lin, Clayton Townsend, and Samantha Vincent, screenplay by Daniel Casey and Justin Lin, story by Justin Lin, Alfredo Boltello, and Daniel Casey, characters by Gary Scott Thompson, starring Vin Diesel, Michelle Rodriguez, Tyrese Gibson, Chris Ludacris Bridges, John Cena, Georgina Brewster, Natalie Amell, uh, Song King, Michael Rooker, Helen Mirren, Kurt Russell, and Charlize Theron. Music by Brian Tyler. Cinematography from Stephen F. Winden. Edited by Greg uh, Deura, uh, Dylan Highsmith, and Kelly Matsumoto. Uh, production companies from One Race Films, Original Films, Roth uh, slash Krenzenberg's Films, Perfect Storm Entertainment. Distributed by Universal Pictures. Uh, internationally, it re uh, released May 19th, 2021. That's like, that's like China and all that. Uh, June 21st, 2021, United States. And June 17th in New Zealand and Australia and other places. Uh, it runs for 145 minutes, around 2 hours and 25 minutes. Uh, the budget for this movie is $200 million dollars. Uh, and the box office is uh, the box office is two hundred seventy point nine million dollars. Plot. Uh, this is getting into spoilers, so spoiler alert. Uh, in nineteen eighty nine, Jack Torrito, uh, J D. Pedro, uh, participates in the last car race of the season with his son Dominic, uh, Vinnie Bennett, and Jacob, played by Finn Cole. And his pit crew, while well, Jacob works, Dom argues with rival racer Kenny Linder, played by Jim Patrick, about his dirty tactics. As Jack and Kenny resumes the race, Kenny cars flips Jack's bumper and causes him to hit a wall and explode, killing him. Dom runs onto the track, but it's held by buddy Michael Rooker, other member of Jack's crew. Dom and Jacob's mourn their father's death. Uh, in prison, Don, played by Vin Diesel, is retired and off-grid, raising his son, Brian, with his wife, Letty, played by Michelle Rodriguez, Roman, uh, played by Tyrese Gibson, Tej Ludacris, uh, Ted, uh, Tej, played by Ludacris, and Ramsey, played by Natalie Amell, uh, arrived with news of Mr. Nobody, played by Kurt Russell, apprehending, uh, Cypher, it's not Chapa, I call it Chapa, but it's Cypher, played by Charlie Theron, uh, but his plane being attacked and her beginning uh, being extracted by rogue agents. The plane crashes in Monsignor, uh, Central America, and the team asks for help in investigating the crash site. Uh, Dom, Dom declines, but Lydia agrees. Dom replies to the distant signal and realizes Jacob, played by John Cena, is behind the hijacking. Um... Cast of Vin Diesel is Dominic Toretto, uh, Michelle Rodriguez is Lydia Ortiz, uh, Tyrus Gibson is Roman Pierce, Chris Ludacris Bridges is Tish Parker, John Cena is Jacob Toretto, Adjourna Brewster is Mia Toretto, Natalie Amell is Ramsey, Song Kang is Hunt Lu, Helen Mirren is Queenie, Kurt Russell is Mr. Nobody, and Charlie's Theron is Cypher. Production In November 2014, the Universal, Pi uh, Universal Pictures Chairwoman Donna Langley told that uh, told the Hollywood Reporter that there will be at least three more films in the franchise after Furious Seven. In October 2017, Diesel revealed on in a Facebook Live video that Justin Lin, who directed the Fast and Furious Tokyo Drift through Fast through Fast and Furious Six, will be returning for the ninth and tenth films. In May 20 uh, May 2018, Daniel Casey was hired to write the screenplay after Morgan left due to his. Uh, his work on the Hobson Shaw spin-off film. Uh, casting in April 2017, Diesel and Dwayne confirmed their returns. In October 2017, Georgina Brewster will portray Mia Trudeau in five of the franchises and 
uh, and five of the franchise's films will be returning for the ninth and tenth films. On April fourth, uh, twenty eighteen, Johnson stated that he is unsure if he is returning for the ninth film. Now let's review this movie. Um, I'm gonna. Tr I mean, I've already spoiled the start, so I'm just gonna. There is major spoilers. Like, if you don't want to be spoiled for this film, don't watch this review, because uh, there is heaps and heaps of spoilers. So be warned. I have warned you, uh, but yeah. Let's get into my F9 spoiler talk. First and Furious 9 uh, starts off, like I said, in the race uh, with Dom and Jacob's father, how he dies uh, because of Jake. He, I forgot the reason why. Uh, was it like Jacob's, like his father wanted to die or something? I can't remember. Like, um... But, that's, where do I, where's a good spoiler to get into it? Let's go with Han's survival. How did he survive? Well, how did he survive? He, well, didn't actually die. Uh, he was working with Mr. Nobody. Uh, if you don't know who Mr. Nobody is, he's basically like the, uh, like the people. He's like the person who goes, oh yeah, you have to do that mission. Like, there's a mission in America or England or, you know. It's like one of those people. So, he works with Han. Um, so, Han survives. Even though Dick is sure he thinks that he killed him. Which didn't. Uh, but he survives because... What was the reason? It was a stupid reason. Um, they were using like these... Or is this technology stuff? I don't know. Uh, and it was to fake his own death, but he wasn't actually there. Uh, so. <laughs> I, <laughs> I don't know. Um, and then what happened to John Cena's character? Well, he turned bad. Then the team, Oslo, I think that's his name, and Cypher turned on him. So then, uh, Jacob went on to the good side with, like, Van, uh, with Dom and Liddy and Tyrese and all that, uh, and Roman and all that. So, the big battle happened in, uh, Edinburgh in England, uh, where the two cars, it was, uh, Jacob driving the Subaru and Vin driving his Dodge Charger into, like, this black big truck, like, trying to crash it. Uh, trying to kill them. Um, yeah, and then you can't forget another big spoiler. Yep, when they say they're going to space, yeah, they literally mean they're going to space. They, uh, Tej and Roman, literally go to space, like physically go to space. Like they're on they're on a Pontiac Fur, uh, on like a plane, and then it like flips off. And they, like, fly up into space to try and destroy the satellite. I'm like, what the... What is... Like, I know that they were going to up the ants for this film. Jesus Christ. This film. Um, it's just crazy. Like, if you have not seen Fast and Furious uh, 9, you need to, well, when it comes out. I know there is some hate, but for me... I'm a huge Fast and Furious fan, so I love this film. Uh, it's not my favourite Fast and Furious movie, uh, but it is still a great, great uh, time. And then Cypher survives. She's just, like, behind the... Uh, she's, like, doing, like, all the magic. And then she just, like... And she just walks off when she's done. She's like, oh, yeah, just walk off. And then... Um, they have magnetic planes and, and they're flying cars. Like, they're no, making like a car sandwich. Like, Dom just uses, like, he like twists this thing and uh, gets magnetics. And then he like made a car sandwich with his cars and these other two cars. I was like, and then, I mean, there was this funny scene in the movie where Ramsey uh, can't drive. 
So she was trying to try. Oh. Um, yeah, this movie does have, have its big humour. Uh, especially from uh, Roman. In my opinion, I think Roman has the most uh, comedic uh, to him, but it's just funny. Uh, this movie. Um, there is one thing that annoyed me. Uh, I think same with other people. Where Roman thinks that he is invisible. Uh, went on for pff, three, four minutes. Like he got like bullet holes into like his. Uh, he got bullet holes. Like he was going. Just like it looked like GDA. Physically, it looked like GDA. Like there was like heaps of bad guys like coming. He was like. He's like. What? Um. This movie. Gee. Oh God. I really did have a blast with this film. I seriously just really enjoy this film. Um, would I recommend it? Yes. This movie was just a blast. Um, it was just fun to watch, and I, yeah, I, it's it's a it's a bundle of joy. But yeah, for my score for F nine or Fast and Furious nine, I'm gonna be giving it. A 4.5 out of 5 stars. Percentage, I'm going to be giving it a 95%. Grade, I'm going to be giving it an A-. minus, And out of 10, I'm going to be giving it a 9.5 out of 10. Thanks for watching my review for Fast and Furious 9, or F9. Uh, stay tuned to my Luca movie review, Fatherhood movie review, Deadpool movie review, Cop Out movie review, and uh, Loki episode 2 uh, review. Thank you for watching. Please subscribe to my channel. Be a big help. Thanks for watching. Take care. Peace.